Well, I thought I'd send you a little more internet glue today. These two cats, this is a very rare occurrence when we have Mia over there, my big fat kitty, um, and Otter here, both of whom refuse to look at the camera, um, on the same in the same place at the same time, unless it's Otter riding Mia's back around the house while Mia runs and screams and tries to shake her off because this cat right here, this is a mean cat right here. Yep, she is. She, the story about how we ended up with Otter, she was a, she was the runt of a feral litter that was living in our wood pile. And the, um, the pit bull from next door, who was a beautifully sweet pit bull, except for where cats were concerned, would come over in the morning, grab a kitten, rend it limb from limb, leave it scattered all over the driveway, and then go home. Well, we tried everything to deal with this pit bull. We tried to move the kittens, blah, blah. It was a mess. Well, finally, we thought they were all gone, and Grant and I came home one day, and we could hear this little one mewling. So Grant very bravely stuck his hand underneath the pallet where the uh, firewood was, didn't even look first, so who knows? She could have been keeping company with a rattler under there for all we knew. And he scooped her up, hissing and spitting and clawing, little tiny piece of nothing. And um, we brought her inside, and she's lived inside ever since. But we think that she was the last one because she was so mean. I think she was the only kitten that could take on that pit bull with any sort of, <laughs> any sort of attitude at all. So... Yeah, she's she is truly a rescue cat. I wish we could have saved the other ones too, but you know, people dump their animals up here all the time. It's drag. And this little girl right here, this is Mia. Mia was from my mom's last litter of kittens when she still had kittens, and I knew I wanted to bring one of them home. They were all pretty much given away. And every time I walked over to the box, Mia, who's got the most beautiful blue eyes in the world, she would run up to me and try to jump out of the box with a scared look on her face like she did not want to be with all those other cats. And now I get it. She's a solitary cat. She doesn't like to be with other cats, other animals. Um, she has bonded with one person, just, just Grant. And um, she doesn't even really like me all that much. So it's kind of funny. Cats are funny. All right, I'm done with my glue. See you guys later. Bye.